What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel, King Ken TV. And today we're going to be doing a recap on the Washington Wizards versus the Charlotte Hornets, man. Now, the game just got done with, and it was a pretty decent game. Nothing too crazy. You see on your screen, man, the Wizards only scored 87 to our 90. To our 97, man. The Hornets played pretty good defense, man, especially in that third quarter. As you can see in the box score, Wizards only scored 14 points in that third quarter. Hornets went crazy and dropped 30. Everything else is pretty close, man. As you see in the first and second quarter, man, just it wasn't nothing too crazy, bro. The Wizards scored 29 and 22 to our 24 and 21. Fourth quarter, we scored the same amount of points with 22. So overall, it was just a back and forth game besides that third quarter. That third quarter, man, the bench came in. Kelly Oubre going crazy. Jaden McDaniel, Jalen McDaniels going crazy, man. And then what's even crazy? Nick Richards, man, getting two blocks. Two blocks in that third quarter. Maybe three, but I, I, I remember two of them, man. Two people tried to dunk on him, and he wasn't happy. He was not happy. Now, let's get into the game leaders real quick. Bradley Bill, what is going on with y'all? Y'all 10 and 4. It seemed like every time we play a good team, they best player don't play that, that well. I don't know if it's because we got Miles on them or Terry on them, but it just seemed like they best player is always getting, like, you know, being frustrated or not having a good stats or statistical game, pretty much, man. Bradley Bill had 24 on 9 to 20 shots. Miles Bridges was all over him. Terry all over him. Caleb Martin or Cody Martin, which yeah, you, you know the Martin brother, he all over him. It just seemed like he was just frustrated, man. Nine and 20 for 24 points. You should at least have at least 30 if you're going to shoot the ball 20 times. But, hey, what do I know? <sighs> for us, man, Terry Rozier, he took over this game, man. 19 points. He really did his thing in the third and fourth quarter, though. I don't know where Gordon Hayward was, man. Gordon been pissing me off lately, but hopefully he can get it together because this dude – I'm not going to say he's holding his back, but he he sometimes he killing the momentum that we be getting. As far as team stats, though, Washington shot 36%. We shot 43% from the field goal. You know, 36 ain't good for them. That's a defensive stop from us. You know, we play really good defense to keep them from shooting over 40. As far as threes, man, they could not hit nothing, even when we didn't contest them. I know they had one three where they could have brought the game a little close. Who was that, KCP? Almost airballed a three, wide open, got the steal but then almost airballed it, barely touched the rim. They shot 19% from three. That wasn't all on us. That was Some of that was on them. Can't hit no threes, you can't win games. They ain't win this game because they couldn't hit threes. We shot 31%. It wasn't much better, but we hit the shots that we need to hit to win this game. As far as turnovers, we had about 11 turnovers. This was a clean game, really, bro. It was only a couple of turnovers throughout the game, 11 from them, 11 from us. I always say, man, 10 turnovers at the max for us to get the dub for sure. We had one over and we still won it. So, hey, can't complain. As far as rebounds, man, we out rebounded them by about 11, 59 for Charlotte, 48 for them. Can't complain on that. Mason Plum, or my, my, yeah, Mason Plumby or Miles Plumby, whichever name his name is, man. Y'all know the Plumby brother and Nick Richards did their thing. It was overall a good game, man. As far as attendance, bro, it didn't look too packed in there. As you can see, compared to, that Warriors game where we sold out, this game, 75%. Nothing too crazy. The tickets probably wasn't even that expensive, so you probably could have went to that game if you had time. Now, as far as the box score leaders, man, Kyle Kuzma. What is going on, man? I was expecting something since you know LaMelo personally. You went out there and shot 2 of 12, 1 of 8 from 3 for 5 points. Sir, I thought you said you wanted to get out of the shadows of LeBron. You ain't getting out of no shadows, man. Let me turn this off real quick before I get a copyright. Well, come on, Kyle. You got to do better, man. Gafford, he did pretty good. 9 to 12, 20 points. 0 of 5 from Spencer Dinwiddie. This is why y'all lost. Wizard fans, like, I know the game over with, so now I can go ahead and tell y'all why y'all lost, man. Wizard fans. Bradley Bill and Dan, Dan Dinwiddie. Well, what is going on, man? Like, Bradley Bill, yeah, he had 24, but, bro, he shot the ball 20 times. Come on now. Y'all got it. Y'all boys, y'all got to be more efficient if y'all want to win games, man. KCP, three points. Y'all starters, bro, it's crazy. It's crazy, man. Only two of y'all starters hit double figures. Y'all not going to win games like that. Miles uh, Harold, Montrez Harold had 15. We wanted to sign him, but I guess he didn't want to come play for us because he wanted to go to L.A. Now he with the Wizards. He's still a hooper, but 
50 with the Wizards. Now, for Hornet fans, man, listen, we did pretty decent. Not good, but decent, man. Gordon Hayward, once again, you you shooting us out of games, bro. 4-14 for eight points, six rebounds, one assist. Come on, Gordon. You didn't even play much in this game, and you wonder why. Bridges, 8 of 15, 17 points, man. Y'all need to pay this, man. Another double-dub, almost at a triple-dub. Miles Plumley and Mason Plumley, 5 of 7, 13 rebounds and 11. That's another double double right there. LaMelo Ball. Now, LaMelo, you too, bro. You ain't getting the pass from me. 4 of 18. Come on, my guy. Come on. You was plus nine. You was plus 19 and a plus minus, but that shooting, bro. Come on. I know it's an off night. Next, next night, you got to get right. 11 points, 14 assists. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. Terry Rozier, though, he, he came in clutch, 9 of 19, 19 points. Once again, you're shooting. Some of the shot selections y'all was taking was questionable, but 19 shots, 19 points, and 19 shots, come on now. Come on now. Kelly Oubre, he came in there and did his thing, 5 of 10 for 14. Jaden McDaniels was probably the most efficient, in my opinion, 4 out of 5 for 11 points. He did what he could. Cody Martin had a plus 20. That is crazy. He didn't even score and had plus 20 and a plus minus. This dude, this dude did his thing on Bradley Bill and uh, Spencer Dinwiddie. Overall, though, it was a good game. It was a good game. When y'all get a chance, go watch the highlights if you ain't get to watch this game, man. This game was – it wasn't nothing too crazy. It's just another – it's another – what's today? Wednesday. It's another Wednesday game, bro. That's all it was. That's all it was. And it won, we, we need to win all the games that we can. We are 9-7, and 5-2 and two at home. Hornet fans, we're trying to get on this dub. Get a win streak going. Y'all need to go to the games, man. Support this team. I'm trying to go to as many games as I can. Y'all should too. Other than that, that's going to do it for this video. Make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next one.